Hello, everyone. Welcome to episode one of our Greg Hastings Paintball 2 Career Mode Let's Play. Now, we're going to be doing a bit of a throwback here. Obviously, this game came out a long time ago, uh, but I am playing it on my PS5. So I wanted to introduce some of you who maybe aren't familiar with this game um, to the career mode. It's a lot of fun. I still enjoy this game. So I wanted to go ahead and start a Let's Play series. So let's go ahead and... You know what, I haven't played in a while, so we'll do the tutorial. So essentially what we're doing is we set up our paintball team, and we get to recruit people, we get to play in different tournaments, and increase their skill sets, so it's like most games um, hey player, come that over are here. similar in nature. I'm going to teach you some basics about playing paintball, so you don't look too silly. Alright, first things first, you're going to get hit with a paintball sooner or later, so it's important to know what to do. Okay, you've just been marked. You need to call yourself out. However, you can try and cheat by wiping off the hit. I don't recommend it, because if you mess it up and you get busted by a ref, your team will be penalized. I told you it was risky. You just cost your team big time. You've gotten a one for one. That means you and one of your teammates got pulled out with you. You may be filling his pods for next game. Paintball is an honor-based sport, okay? I would not recommend wiping. I always bonus ball cheaters anyway. Now that you know what it's like to be shot with a paintball, it's your turn to shoot. Run to that bunker, take aim, and try to shoot those wooden targets. Oh, over here. Okay, now shoot at him. Not bad. You'll get better with time for sure. You can focus in on the target if you want, but you may move a bit slower. Electronic markers usually come with a double trigger, so you can really maximize the rate of fire. Use both fingers and let's see how fast you can empty your hopper on those targets. You never need to wait until your hopper is completely empty before you reload. It's wise to top off your hopper before you head into a fight. First of all, until you earn better skills, Reloading while behind cover is always a good idea. Hopefully when you get better, you will realize when and where not to reload. Sometimes you'll just want to quickly top off your loader. The sport of paintball is all about cover. Let's try and get your rookie shape behind this bunker. It's only chest high, so just crouch down. As you get better at this, you'll realize the importance of not popping back up in the same location. Some bunkers are even shorter, so you're going to have to really eat some dirt to get behind them. Huh. Go completely prone and you'll see what I mean. Okay, so you'll need to get super low to the ground on many occasions, but you'll not be able to move very fast. Get your butt back to the crouch position before you make a move. The best players learn to snap out from behind cover and minimize your exposure. Remember, if your gun is behind cover, then you are behind cover. The hand you hold your gun in determines the way you're going to snap out. Try switching hands and firing to get a feel for it. All right, enough drills. You need some live practice. We're about to jump into a rec ball game on another field, so come on over and join us. I'll even let you borrow my Infinity Legend so you can see what a quality marker feels like. Come on, let's rock! the hell is that button on a PS5 controller? <laughs> um, let's see. Maybe this one? Bro, I don't know what that button is on here. I don't have the select button on here.
Yeah, there's not a select button on the PS5 controller. Hmm. Maybe I could just quit it. All right, so we're gonna be called the about the wise guys how about that wise guys must have at least three team team members to play in an, an event recruit new team members by highlighting an empty player and extra trade okay so we need three people. Oh, they all kind of suck. <laughs> Let's get a super young team. random people because none of them really have stats anyway. Oh, I'm just swapping out the same person over and over here. Okay, no, we're good. Sweet. By right, selecting events. Okay, so this is a two flag capture the flag tournament, 3v3. Three three three. All right, let's get started. I haven't really set up my loadouts or anything, so we'll just do our best here. I don't think you can even adjust Speed the difficulties. Ball's no joke. The teams that love it are very competitive, so be ready for some serious challengers. My homegirl, B. Youngs, is willing to do me a favor and stick with you and your team so she can give you some pointers you will most definitely need. Remember, she's a sharp veteran and a longtime captain of Team Destiny, so you better believe she knows what she's talking about. Plus, she's happy to help us spank Nikki's team. Oh no, they don't have anyone. We're just capturing the flag now. Blue, grab the flag. Won't get away with too many of those fellas. All right, round two. I don't think I have any replacement paint, so I need to be careful. No way, Rap! No way! Freeze! 
Nobody's left, just me. Blue, grab the flag. Blue, capture the flag. Oh, match two. All right. Let's see how we do here. This game starts to get really challenging. Hey, after the first ten minute or two. Blue, right. grab the flag. <laughs> two people left. Captured the flag. Anybody? Let's mow him down. Grab the flag. Blue captured the flag. I saw your moves out there. You did really well today. I told you B knows your stuff. Spend your cash to unlock gear, draft players, and buy training for your team members successful from the team man manager menu. The members of Sprags have respect for your team and would be honored to join your path to glory. Recruit members from the trade menu. You can now buy this gear for your team from the gear menu. You've been invited to the Boston Open. Time to show off your skills. Sweet. All right, guys. So won our first tournament, so we're doing well. In the next episode, we're going to go ahead and try out the Boston Open, see how we do there, and we'll continue on with our career mode on Greg Hastings Paintball. If you all enjoyed this episode, please consider giving this video a like. Please also consider subscribing to the channel. Catch you all the next episode very soon.